Sellafield was the site of the world's first commercial nuclear reactor in 1956. Though Sellafield no longer generates power, it's home to 1,290 cubic meters of high-level nuclear waste and 8,150 cubic meters of spent nuclear fuel. Together, enough to fill 284 20-foot-long cargo containers. Representing more than 90% of the UK's total industrial radioactivity, the cesium-137 alone, should it ever be released, would cause an event nearly 100 times the size of the Chernobyl disaster. We're in an active facility, which is processing here, vitrifying waste over here. There's, there's a facility you know, 150 feet over there that has stuff in there that we're not allowed to know about. 